And at least 1,000 youth have been empowered by the Lagos State Government with different work tools as part of measures to make them self-reliant and wealth creators. Speaking at the ceremony, Governor Babajide Sonwolu maintained that collective effort is needed to ensure sustainable growth of micro-enterprises. Plus TV News correspondent Lovi Kukoyedoko tells us more in this report. One of the economic development and poverty eradication strategy programs of Governor Babajide Sawunu's administration. The Micro Enterprise Support Initiative Program is designed to empower the indigent, vulnerable, and graduates of the skills acquisition centers in Lagos State. Not less than 11,885 youths have been empowered through the program since the inception of the present government of the state. Cecilia Dada is the Commissioner for Wealth Creation and Poverty Alleviation, Lagos State. She highlights more on the program. Today, amongst the beneficiaries are 700 graduates from my 19 skills acquisition centers who graduated few weeks ago. Mr. Governor did promise to empower them, and indeed, Mr. Talk and Do has done it again. Also, amongst the beneficiaries are uh, people getting lawyer births. They are not just getting the births. This morning, they have also been trained on how to manage the poultry business. Governor Babajide Sawulu was represented by his deputy, Femi Hamzat, he says the initiative is a practical demonstration of the social inclusion policy geared towards ensuring that no one is left behind. The state has various programs. Some few weeks ago, what have we graduated down in 4,000 something, 96 something, 4,926 or something in this same place? And a lot of them are coming back to give testimony they are doing well, they, they started building their businesses. So that is what my message to you is. That's what Lagos State wants from you. So that next year, you have employed two more people, or you have employed three more people, or even employed one person. That way, that's the only way nations develop. The governor charges beneficiaries not to sell the equipments, but make good use of them. It's about the fact that you need to be prepared. You know, you need to do bookkeeping. How do you keep, keep accounts? How do you progress your, your, your business? How do you, there will be challenges. But remember, those challenges, some people will say, hey, you see, no, no problem gets solved by complaining. Problem gets solved when people take actions. Some of the overjoyed beneficiaries speak with Plus TV News. Just call me that Lagos State uh, government want to give us a, want to give us machine that I should come. So getting to this place, I was so surprised and I was so happy. For the youth, they should be dedicated in what they are doing. They should be focused. They should be determined. They should be disciplined in whatever they are doing. And as far they put God first and they are trustworthy in what they are doing, I believe in no time God so will take them to their destination. Beneficiaries smile home with sewing machines, professional hair dryers, mini machines, bobbing clippers with sterilizing units and generators, popcorn machines, shawarma grillers, toasting machines, and snail pens, among others. Love Ikuku Oyedoku. Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.